Hi guys, here we have a very simple trigonometric problem which says sine 18 degrees times sine 54 degrees equals what? You have an interestingly simple answer for this one. Now what we are going to do is first we'll write sine 18 degrees then we are going to rewrite sine 54 degrees as cos 36 degrees. Now notice that 36 degrees is the double of 18 degrees. So what we are going to do, we are going to use double angle formula for sine. So we have sine 2 theta is equal to 2 sine theta cos theta. So we are going to apply that. But how can we apply when we don't have 2 and cos theta? So we are going to take 2 in numerator and denominator and then put the sine 18 degrees and then now put cos 18 degrees as you have put cos 18 degrees at top you have to put it at the bottom as well now that's multiplied to cos 36 degrees so we're going to use double angle formula here for 2 sine 18 degrees cos 18 degrees 2 sine theta cos theta is equal to sine 2 theta so we are going to take double of 18 degrees that's double of 18 is 36 so you have sine 36 degrees cos 36 degrees over 2 cos 18 degrees. Now again we have 36, 36 again you can apply for double angle. Uh, but before that you need to have the 2. So multiply and divide top and bottom by 2. So you have 2 sine 36 degrees cos 36 degrees over 4 cos 18 degrees. Now we can apply the same thing back. That's twice of 36 is 72. So we'll have 2 times 36 is 72. So we'll have sine 72 degrees over 4 cos 18 degrees. However, sine 72 degrees is equal to cos 18 degrees because those two angles are complementary angles, which means that the sum is 90 degrees. So you can cross out the two angles so you're left with one quarter and that's your answer thank you so much for watching bye bye take care